Hello friends, in the previous video we applied the partition loads on the beams. In this video we will learn how to apply the loads on these slabs, okay? Alright, so uh, let us see the loads that were defined earlier. Okay, so on. Okay, so we have already applied the partition parapet and the partition load, and on this slab we have got the floor finish, uh, live load, and greater less than or equal to three and greater than three. Okay, and we don't have earthquake load on this slab. Okay, so now we'll apply the floor finish load and the live load on the slab. Right for that, what we have to do, we just uh, go to the first floor because we don't have any slab on the ground floor. Right, we select the uh, slab over here. We don't select this slab uh, because we'll do this portion of the staircase separately. Okay, and what we do, we go to assign and click on cell loads and click on uniform loads. Right, so the load pattern we'll be uh, applying is the floor. Okay, so let's apply the live load. Okay, so live load is less than or equal to 3 because we will be applying live load to kilometer per meter square and this value comes from the code that is followed in your country. So in my country, IS 875 part 2 is followed and in the residential building, in living and all kinds of rooms, the live load of 2 kilometer per meter square is applied and the direction is gravity and we apply the load. Okay, okay, so after the load has been applied, so if you want to remove these, you know, numbers, so what you can do, you can go to assign and clear display of assigns, it will just remove that designation, right? So, uh, alternatively, if you have to apply the load, what you can do is that, go to select, click on select and click on properties and click on slab sections. Okay, so after that, if we click on slab and click on select, so this, this will do is that it will select all these slabs, okay? So you cannot see the selection I don't know why but uh, this slab has been selected as you can see in the uh, 3d view okay so I'll, I'll show you display clear okay, so assign clear display of science so you can see all these slabs have been selected except for this staircase portion okay so we'll do that separately right so after that what we can do is that go to assign and click on uh, frame loads okay so sorry click on cell loads and click on uniform and what we do, we apply the live load as two kilonewton per meter square. And of, okay, so two kilonewton per meter square, right? And if we do the replace existing loads, it will replace the previously applied two kilonewton per meter square load. And if we, however, click on add existing load, it will add to the previously applied load and the resultant load will be four kilonewton per meter square, okay? So we'll do replace and click on okay.